Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's Name That Game featuring Unpacking. This is the series where I play a level of unpacking, and while I'm doing that, I'm going to read out reviews for a game. It is your job to try to figure out which game I'm reading the reviews for. So go ahead and leave your guess down in the comments. At the end of the series, I will make an episode revealing all of the answers. So stay tuned for that coming out in a few weeks. All right, let's get into it. All right, so here we are. It is the last level of unpacking. I'm going to split it into two episodes. And the game that I'm going to be talking about today is kind of old and and kind of well known with a certain type of player. That's so vague, but I can't I can't give away too much more. Okay, I'll just read out the reviews. The first one says, playing this game after 16 years, need I say more? So in unpacking, it looks like I have moved into a really nice house. So I'm pretty psyched about that. I love this umbrella stand. Okay, I, I can't, I can't leave it like that. They all have to be turned the same way. So 16 years. Well, that is a long time. I did say it was old. Is there a game out there that you have played for nearly two decades? I'm curious to know. So let's move into the living room next and look at that. Oh, it's pretty. Yeah, wow, moving up in life in the game. Yeah, we're gonna have lots of video games. It's what we do. We're gamers. The next review says, multiplayer friendly, fantastic gameplay, always someone playing, and a ton of customization. Too good of a game to pass up. Best Steam game by far. So it is a game you can find on Steam. Always someone playing and multiplayer. Hmm. Could I put the Wii games beside it? I sure can. I could even tuck them away a little bit. Ah, the alien head made it. Let's put it front and center because it's so weird. Jubble? Jubble? That's what that game, that's what that board game is called. It's Jubble. And it, Nuclear Narwhals. Oh, okay. I want to play that. I don't, I don't know what that is. That sounds awesome. Okay, there's too many games. I never thought that I would say this. But there's too many. And yeah, there's a garage. That's fine, you can't go in there, but there's a garage. Okay. Now, as for these games, I think we're gonna try to fit them all along here. Wow, I just got so into that. And then we've got these other little games here. I really want them to fit in here. I don't think it's gonna happen. Okay, that room's looking nice. Go into the bathroom. Let's read another review. You shoot gun, you die. You shoot gun again, you kill enemy, you die again. And the cycle repeats. So a lot of Gunplay sounds like. There we go. Put that right in the center because it's adorable. Creams can go up here. Um. Oh, this is a rubber ducky. Wait, 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 wait. Oh my god, where am I going? Oh, I was at the upstairs bathroom. Crib? We having a baby? Okay, let's just go back downstairs. Let's do that bathroom. Whoopsie. Why, why can I put it on the toilet and not like behind the toilet? Bizarre. Review number four says, better than Fortnite. Well, you didn't think it was Fortnite anyway because Fortnite's not 16 years old. Oh, we won an award. A business award? Somebody won an award. Better than Fortnite, huh? 
Does that just mean that it's better than Fortnite, or does that give you a clue as to what kind of game it is? It's, but is it really that hard to be better than Fortnite? That's my other question. So it really still could be anything. Because it's not that hard to get better than Fortnite. Uh, I'm giving Fortnite a lot of crap. I've never actually played it. Uh, is that a wrist brace? Okay, this is gonna bug me. That's better? Is it? Is it better? Oh, this is a uh, printer paper. Okay, let's put some of these coil books down here. Oh, it fits perfectly. As long as there's not another one. Yeah, I think the main character is a cartoonist. The art with these little like cartoon thingies everywhere. Now there's books, or maybe they they make children's books. It's all coming together, you guys. Well, this just seems a little bit off. It seems like it should be like right here or here. Pretty sure she writes children's books. You know, I might move all the books into the office. That does kind of make sense, doesn't it? <clears throat> okay, no more coiled books. Oh! Why? Okay. Now, no more coiled books. Move my little award. Yeah, that's looking good. Put this lava lamp back there. That's fine up there. My little ukulele. Okay. The next review says, Grass grows, birds fly, sun shines, and brother, I hurt people. I'm a force of nature. We're going to move into the kitchen. I think if you know, you know. For that one. I'm very glad the magnets made it. Okay, well, it doesn't make sense to have that very low. Little magnet guides up there. I like that the kitchen stuff matches. The next review says... Realistic and fun simulation of Los Angeles, California. You can play either the Crips or the Bloods. That's interesting. So a realistic portrayal of... Or simulation of Los Angeles. And you can choose between two... I'll just say factions. Just piling everything on the floor. Like, is this how you actually unpack? Nope. So, the problem with having the microwave right there is that this is in the way, so we're going to have to change that. These are more magnets. Well, these magnets took up a lot of room in that box. The next review says... Don't that make sense to anybody? Okay, knife block should definitely go in there. And then I think we're gonna have to put some, like, the cleaning supplies under here. Alright, we're getting close on the kitchen. Coffee stuff, now, okay. Coffee stuff we want easily accessible. Oh my gosh, I can put the microwave up here? Yes! Yes! No, the glasses should go up here. Oh, this is a lot to... To think about <laughs> in a way okay water bottles up here got it but then the mugs need to be accessible that one doesn't belong need to be accessible to the coffee stuff okay so then the coffee stuff is here so it's easy to make coffee in the morning review number eight just says medic In bold letters. Medic. You know, I just, I don't know where to put this pan. I bet you I'm supposed to put it under here. 
Yep. It fit. The matches still fit. They do. And then the bowl. And then the this whale was in the study last time. So I put it back in there. I think we just have one room left. Just going to go through these rooms quick. Because there's a lot of them. Yep. Everything's looking good. Oh, I didn't... They've got a bunch of sauces. Okay. There's a bunch of stuff that I didn't put away. Oh, ooh. The cutting board up there. That's the way to do it. There we go. Okay. Now I think I'm done with the kitchen. To the last room. Review number nine says... Sandwich. Here's your partner. Found him. Poster goes in the kitchen. Where does it go? I don't know. Right there. Okay, so I'm going to move the big books up here. The smaller ones can go down here. Put this in the living room. Not in front of the TV. Office? no room. No, there's room. Oh, I'll make room. There we go. Review number 10. Oh, I found a bunch more books. Why? Why does it have to be like that? I'm just going to get these wine glasses put away quick. Hold on, we'll get to the last one. Hold on, everybody. It's a little salt and peppers. A little coasters. Okay, now last one. If you thought it was Overwatch 2, you are wrong. Because the last review says... Better than Overwatch 2. And with that, I think we are finished the main floor... And, you know, when I finish upstairs, it'll tell me what I've put, what I can and cannot do. Like that plant, for example. Pretty sure it's not allowed to be there. But I like it there. So I'm going to hope that they don't get, the game get, doesn't get upset with me for putting this plant here. So yeah, that's it for the main floor of this level. And that is it for the reviews that I was reading out. If you think you know what game I was reading the reviews for, please leave your guess down below in the comments. And like I said before, I will put out an episode in a couple of weeks letting you know what the answers are. Thank you so much for watching. Like the video if you've had fun with me today. And subscribe to the channel too for more content. I'll see you in the next one. Bye!